Happy hello to all. In this video, I will try to narrate the story of Anamali. Within 8 minutes, with 150 frames, on 9 episodes. Anamali is a Tamil film released on 1992. But why should we revisit that now on 2020? Keep watching to know why. Let me introduce the characters one by one. Anamali is an innocent, kind hearted, emotional, honest, angry young man with a lot of courage. And he loves people. He is an hard working individual ever since his childhood. He owns some cows and he delivers milk to the people. Basically, he is a milkman. He owns a house built by his father, along with 20 ground land in Madras Mount Road. And just like any other mother, Anamali, and the house which her husband had built, is the world to Sivagami. And she wants both to be with her till last. Punchacharam is Anamali's cousin, he always speaks butler English. And he calls himself as Punch. Anamali is brother Mountain. And even Baby Bull is cowboy. He will always be with Anamali no matter what. Ashok is Anamali's friend. He is rich, he is a good soul who considers Anamali as his brother. He lost his mother by birth and brought up by his father. Gangadharan is Ashok's father. He doesn't like Ashok's friendship with Anamali, due to status issues. The story begins with the friendship between Anamali and Ashok. They are friends since childhood over an interesting incident, and ever since then, they became close friends and brothers, eventually. And now Ashok has become a part of Anamali's family. They both share a great bonding, that played a major role in deciding their love interest, and their marriage as well. One fine day, Ashok wants to build a five-star hotel at Anamali's land, and asks for his permission. After knowing there is no issue for his house and cow shed, Anamali happily agrees to it. But Ashok's father had other ideas, he decided to acquire the entire land, and Anamali's house as well. Without Ashok's consent, he used Anamali's innocence, and made him sign in the empty document, and Anamali unknowingly did that, trusting him. And then comes the hotel inauguration day. The conflict begins, when Anamali came to know about Ashok's father's plan, to demolish his house. He wants to save the house for his mother. So he questions Ashok and it became an argument. At the heat of the moment he slapped Ashok's father. And in turn Ashok slapped him. And Anamali couldn't bear it, as it came from his dearest friend. That incident touched the ego of Ashok and his father. And out of anger, they planned to demolish Anamali's house immediately. On the other hand, Anamali was feeling guilty of losing his friendship. And before he could think of anything, the goons demolished his house. All his hope, trust, and belief was shattered right in front of him. His situation now is similar to most of the people during this COVID-19 and lockdown. Along with his house, he lost his happiness, friendship, innocence. The only thing left with him now is his courage. He couldn't bear the loss of his house, as his family believed, his father's soul was in it. Demolishing that, touched the raw nerve of Anamali, and with all his courage and anger, he went back to Ashok. And challenged him that, he will grow bigger than him, and will make him realize, the pain of losing. And if not, After that challenge, Anamali took loan from a bank, 
and bought few more cows. He thought smart, and started milk sweets, ghee, and dairy products production. And with his hard work and consistency, within 20 years, he built a new posh house, a five-star hotel, bought a new car, and is in the verge of achieving, what he has said. And Namla has become the president of, the Hotel Owners Association, defeating Ashok, thereby accomplishing his challenge. Anamalai slowly conquers Ashok's business empire, and even bought his house in the auction. And if you ever get a chance, to give it back to someone, then do it like. Maleda, Annamala. The main reason why I chose to narrate this story, is this episode. After achieving all the name, fame, wealth, and accomplishing the challenge he made, Anamalai realizes that, he lost his happiness long back. He missed his real self. It is always the good memories that gives us the happiness. Anamalai, decides to give back Ashok's house to him which he bought an auction, and wants to patch up with him. And become the person he used to be before. And the story ends. With Anamalai, patching up with Ashok. <laughs>